Good morning, Columbia. This is Columbia Cougar News. Good morning, CHS. I'm Luke. And I'm Drew, and this is Columbia Cougar News. Students remember, there is no school tomorrow for Election Day, and there is no school Thursday and Friday for a teacher's convention. Turn up. Amir and Luke have finished filming a new pop culture segment. Let's check it out. Hey, Columbia. Today, we're going around the halls asking people about the Cardi B, Nicki Minaj feud. Here we go. Hey, so how do you feel about the Cardi, Nicki beef? Um, on Instagram. I think it's kind of dumb. Like, they're both really good artists, and I just think they're just fighting to get revenue. Who do you like better? Uh, Cardi B. Oh. <laughs> How do you feel about the Nicki and Cardi beef all over Instagram? Um, I feel like they're gonna be forced to become friends at one point, so mm. it's gonna end soon. Who do you like better? Nicki. Yeah, that's the runner. What about the Nicki and Cardi beef? What? <laughs> Nicki Minaj, Cardi B? Huh? Nicki who? Next Tuesday, November 13th, is the Student Council Volleyball Tournament. Grab your six favorite people to form a team. It is $5 per person to play. Stay tuned for more announcements about the event. Winter athletes, don't forget to turn in your athletic forms to Vanessa ASAP. And finally, we are bringing back an old favorite, math and dance. Let's see it, Lucetta. Welcome back to dance math class. Today, we're gonna do some calculus. We're gonna learn when a function increases and decreases based on calculus alone. So when does a function increase to decrease? Well, if you have a parabola whose vertex is at the point two, seven, say, when does the function increase? Well, it increases as X gets bigger, Y gets bigger. What happens to the slopes of the tangent lines at all the points where it's increasing? What kind of slopes are all of these lines? Well, these lines are all positive slopes, which means we can generalize this and say, when the derivative of the function is greater than zero, your function is increasing. Now, if the function is decreasing, what do you think is going to happen? Well, look at all your tangent lines. All the slopes of those lines are going to be negative numbers. Therefore, if the derivative is less than zero, your function is decreasing. Those are all your announcements for today, CHS. Make sure you turn into the PA for any announcements and updates. Oh, I'm Luke. And I'm Drew, and this is CCN. <laughs>